market. Now believe me when I say, these chickens were not ready to go to market. And I told McCole as much. He said to me, Toby, you're a tram engine. What do you know about chickens? I said, son, I'm over a hundred years old, a trained animal exorcist, and my coach Henrietta was nearly turned into a hen house on at least one occasion. I know a thing or two about chickens. Who are you talking to? Oh, hello there, Thomas. I was just talking to Henrietta here. You're talking to the coach? Well, of course. Don't you ever talk to Annie and Clarabelle? Well, yeah, but Annie and Clarabelle have faces. Henrietta doesn't. Whoa! Hold your hoppers there, partner. You can't just go around saying Rolling Stock don't have no faces. But she doesn't. Yeah, but you can't say it. But how can she talk if she doesn't have a mouth? Well, I can hear her just fine. Oh, really? Hello, Henrietta. How are you this evening? She's not talking to you. Why is that? You're a fascist. <laughs> I think you mean fascist. That too. Ugh. Well, go on then. What's a fascist? Oh my gosh, Henrietta, he doesn't even know. <sighs> a fascist is someone who is prejudiced against vehicles on the basis of their embedded face or lack thereof entirely. Embedded face? Yeah, you know, like, uh, Harold, Jeremy, Coraline, Lightning McQueen, or... Or Annie and Clarabelle. Aha! See? I can't be a fascist. My coaches have embedded faces. Yep. <sighs> That's what they all say. Huh. Well, if I'm a fascist, I guess Brit and David were too. After all, Boko, Daisy, Bulgy, and others had embedded faces in the railway series, but not in the television show. Oh, yeah? Yeah. And frankly, I wish Annie and Clarabelle got the same treatment. <gasps> it would have made the universe more creatively consistent. How could you say such a thing about your own coaches? The diversity of faces in the railway series was beautiful. The TV show was poorer for not having had as much. Oh, please. Imagine if all the characters with two cabs had a front and rear face like they do in the books. How bizarre and terrifying would that be? No one would ever do that on screen. Oh, really? Tell that to Diesel D199. Ah! Dude, that's messed up. <sighs> you are a terrible example for children everywhere.